Safest thing you can always do is keep your toes down. <laughs> toes down, legs straight. It's being considered the next big water sport. It's popular in resort destinations such as Hawaii and Mexico. So why not here in Kelowna? I saw the video and I couldn't believe my eyes. I didn't even, I didn't even think this could be possible. Local resident Devin Spittle was inspired by a YouTube video. He knew he had to try it and wasted no time figuring out what it took to flyboard. I flew down to Utah, got my training as, as an instructor, and I bought all the equipment, brought it back to Kelowna. I really felt like Kelowna needed to have this kind of activity. But how exactly does it work? Uh, basically, there's a giant fire hose attached to a sea -Doo and all the thrust, all the water pressure from that sea -Doo gets pushed through the fire hose and out the board and to the side of these two nozzles. It felt like Iron Man. It felt like Iron Man, it was great. While just hovering like Iron Man may seem like task enough for some, flyboarding can be extreme, doing dolphin dives, backflips, and 360s. If once they're ready, and they can handle the water pressure, I give them more power and they can get more height. And you can get up to about 35 feet. Try snowboarding first. It would definitely be a better for you. Spittle runs Okanagan Flyboard with his sister. They're based out of the El Dorado Boat Launch and Gyro Beach. If you're interested in taking flight, check out okflyboard.com. Jen Zielinski in Kelowna for Castanet News.